with Miriam Voss. We just uh, had a repeat, a double win yesterday and today. Uh, you've won in the past year as well. You were here last year, didn't you win? Last year the same, yeah. Yes. I won the short track and the, and the cross country. And well, yeah, it's always nice to get back uh, to a place where you've won and uh, good memories and a good feeling again. Well, yeah. You come back here for Couldn't be better. Good. Um, with your bike, with you coming here for your company as well. Um, if you weren't running this race, if you weren't in this one, where would you be today? I'd probably be in the Energy Wap Tour riding a road race uh, in, the, in the Netherlands. Mm -hmm. um, I'll be asleep now, actually, but, uh, <laughs> at this time. But my teammates are doing, my road teammates are doing well in the, in the Netherlands, and uh, I try to keep uh, for, uh, for, for Live Giant and for uh, Rabobank here and uh, mm -hmm. make some, uh, some good. Uh, time here. This is a very different uh, well, different course than last year. Um, did you find it was more custom to you? you? You beat the field by quite a bit this year. Uh, well, yeah, uh, well, I liked the short track yesterday. Uh, it was uh, a, a bit more uh, technical than the last year's short track and this course was uh, was okay, but it's, it's a long ride, so uh, you have to think about uh, where, where, where are you going to spend the, the energy in. And mm -hmm. So yes, it was a, a bit more tactical. You're really well known for your timing, when you're going to take off. I've seen you win the World Championships abroad, etc. Yesterday was the same way. You, you took the turn over there and then you went out and sprinted out. And you got to get 100 meters in no time flat. Uh, today, what was your strategy for the kick out? Huh. Oh yeah, yes, today and again I've sort of uh, been thinking about the tactics because I know on the really steep parts it's going to be hard for me to drop uh, Katerina. Uh, it's more on the leather and the, the, the power parts that I can have for a beaker. So uh, I've been thinking and then you, yeah, well at five miles ago was a fire road up. Bit of, bit of a headwind, mm -hmm. it was a good big place, but still, yeah, you have to keep on pushing. And uh, you know, the tactics uh, you take from the road, it's constantly playing tactics and thinking about what will the other be doing and yeah. working together with your teammates. And well, mountain bike is, is different, but yeah, well, sometimes you can take the advantage of some uh, different disciplines. So, you were staying on each other's wheel quite a while, and then you. You've We've been entered. pushing each other quite quite long, yeah. From here, actually, when we uh, when we entered here and uh, went in, into the final lap, we constantly have been overtaking each other and, and pushing. Yeah. Do you actually? Uh, this happens with the men a lot. They'll actually talk to each other at the last the last uh, four or five hundred meters and uh, when they're going to kick out. Does that ever happen with you and uh, any of your rivals? Uh, it happens, but yeah, well, we were up with the two of us here, so it was no no real talking. Okay. Well, in uh, Canada, do you ever plan on coming uh, up north and well, racing up there? I hope the World Cup will come back in Quebec. It was great fun on the Road World Cup uh, there. Pretty hard, of course, but uh, it would be good to have uh, World Cups again outside uh, Europe and well, there's one in China. But you have one again uh, in Canada. Yeah, we'd love to see you there. And welcome back to California. Well, if you want to repeat double next year or two, we'll be there and <laughs> happy to see you again. One last question. Do you ever, you're only 26 years old, you have uh, won in so many disciplines and various times. What is your motivation? I mean, you're still a young woman, but you've got so many victories behind you. Is it. Is just, something inside of you? Is I there really a... like to go out on the bike and I love the competition. Like here, it's it's the game, pushing yourself to the max, being out there with the other girls. And, well, yeah, well, that's that's what I like. And uh, as you say, I've, I've done quite a lot, but it's still the thing I love, that I love most. And uh, I, I enjoy it every day. Will you ever be a manager, do you think, or of a team in the future, or maybe write a book? Uh, I have a book in Dutch, <laughs> but uh, well, yeah, well, yeah, it's it's nice to share the, your your thoughts, to share your experience, and it can be just talking here with other women or girls, or writing a book, or being maybe uh, support in the, in the team or something. So I'm not done yet, but uh, I hope to do that in the future. Yeah.
Yesterday when you went, there was a lot of little girls right on the side here. They actually, I think it's a, it's a team here, and they were admiring you, and they just love being here. And uh, it was a really magic moment because you're their hero, and they look up to you, and it's a great inspiration for the young girls of today. That's, that's fantastic. You see more and more women on bikes, girls on bikes, and it's just um, well, getting bigger and bigger all around the world. And, well, it's good. Uh, I, d I don't want to be famous or something, but it's good that you can be an inspiration for, uh, for these other people. Thank you so much. Thank you.